Hello and welcome back to Wasteland 2. So, we are in the Temple of Titan. Well, we've just left it technically. And we're going to go clear out the canyon and then we might be done with Arizona. Which is crazy. Uh, I mean, what have we got left? Oh no, we still have... We still have to go to the, uh, to the prison. But then we'll be done with Arizona. Yeah, we're going to head this way. Now, I will say I have, a, uh, I have a fan running while this game is also on. And I couldn't hear it in any of my test recordings, but if you can, please let me know and I will, uh, yeah, get rid of it for future recordings. But basically, it's right now it's a bit of a necessary evil. It's quite hot. Not as hot as Arizona or as hot as these dead bodies. Right, uh, let's have a look. Charred corpses, barely recognizable as human, lie in a large burning pile. The smell is awful. Well... That's horrible, obviously. Um, I don't know what I'm expecting to find here. Oh, wait, who's Corrin Kane? Let me quick save. Hello. Psst. A servant of the mushroom cloud stalks in the shadows near the path. He keeps looking over his shoulder and acting very suspicious. When he sees you, he waves you over. I'm so glad you came back this way. I was hoping you would. Uh, why were you hoping? Because I want to join you. You see, I, uh, I recently had something of a crisis of faith when I learned that our Titan was a... Please don't tell anyone you heard this from me. A fake. It really made me think. What are we blowing ourselves up for if our god isn't real? So I've decided to leave the servants and search for a real god. And since you rangers are known for wandering the wasteland and meeting all kinds of people, I thought you would be the ones to do my searching with. So, what do you say? Um... Which god are you looking for? Oh, that doesn't matter. Any god will do. As long as someone can prove to me that they are real. You see, I'm a very spiritual person. So having faith means a lot to me. I just need to find a faith worthy of my faith. If you join us, what do you bring to the party? Well, as a former mad monk, I am something of an explosives expert, and not just in the throwing them at people wildly sense. I can give you more bang for your buck. <laughs> sure. All right, who's going to take a back seat? I think it has to be Chisel who takes a back seat here. Just thinking about it? Yeah, probably. Brother Kane is a servant of the Mushroom Cloud who has second thoughts about blowing himself up for the glory of Titan. Instead, he wants to travel the world in the hopes of finding a god with a better retirement plan. Though he's also using a hatchet. He is kind of Takayuki. In every way. Uh, apart from strength. I don't know. I think I'm going to have to choose Chisel here. Then we lose our blunt for what the f what? I was in a menu. You can't do that to me. I was in a menu. Right. Run up here. It's fine. Maybe take another step. Yeah. Um. Head out. Then switch weapon fire mode. There we go. Not enough for two? Okay. Forward. Bang. Not quite. Forward. Shoot. Again, yeah, no. Keep taking shots. That's a zero percent. Why did I even try it? That's also a zero percent. Right, get up here. Hopefully that hasn't screwed our uh, thing. That was a no there. Yep, still a no. Punch him. All right, back here. I'm so glad you came back this way. I was hoping you would. Goodbye. 
have Rangers. to reload. Join was already discussed. All right. Well, you know, it's my fault for taking so long. Who are we going to replace? Um, actually, you know what? Now that we know we can recruit them, uh, let's just have a look. I want to replace Chisel for just now. We'll chuck a bunch of this stuff on Takayuki. Probably don't need to, but we will anyway for just now. As in, it will all jump to Buffalo, but I'm just going to chuck it on Takayuki while we're uh, have a moment of peace. Yeah, all of those bullets as well. That as well. Keep going, keep going. The Uzi. Wait, he has an Uzi on him the whole time? That must have been Ralphie's Uzi. Maybe it distributes all the loot when you get it. Maybe it doesn't actually, uh, you know, give loot. It just, uh, like, it doesn't give it all to Buffalo. It just distributes. Maybe that's it. Okay. I think that's fine. That's mine. Oh, when we try to take the pickle. I see. Ring. Hey. I'm so glad you came back because I you see. So. Oh. Yeah. Well, as a. Uh, bye, Chisel. Excellent. This is great. My first step on my journey of spiritual discovery. I can't wait to get started. What's Chisel doing there? He's just standing. Okay. Um. So he has no weapons. Does he have no skill? Wait, yeah, he has skill and bladed weapons, but he didn't come with any weapons. What? Is that really his only weapon skill? I only want them so I can hand them in. Uh. We can carry that for just now. Uh, anything else? Oh no, what's our weight like? Yeah, okay, so you've still got a little bit left to ditch. How about that? And... That, and that. Those. Those. Okay. We'll give him an Uzi. We'll give him a shotgun. We'll give him to reload. Wait, he doesn't have any ammo for the Uzi, the Thompson then. Right. Uh, and then, for a secondary, we do- yeah, we have some shotgun shells that have been lying around here. I might give him a shotgun, but, uh, I suspect we're just gonna leave him at base. Thinking about it? Yeah, give him all those. Okay. Cool. Right. Quick save. We'll quickly go and- does he have any other skills? Uh, that's the thing I should check. He's good with demolitions. Perks, so he has the improved explosive perk. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so he's basically got everything Takayuki has. Except, like, a hundred less health. Right, um, hey Chisel. Need some help from the baddest, meanest, most nope. dangerous... You're gonna wish you had a killer like me. I really hope that Chisel isn't permanently gone. I hope he's not. He shouldn't be. Chisel gets to join this fight. Hey, don't shoot me. Thank you. Appreciate it. Right. Punch him. And again. Just gonna end his turn, like, it's not gonna happen. Very solid. Grab the loot. Do a little distribution. Head up here. Okay. Some more destruction. Oh, right. These guys are against us, huh? Yep, yep, assholes. I didn't even realize he looked friendly for a second. Um, yeah. Get there and blast one to the back. That didn't kill him. He did burn, so he's probably dead. Right, end turn. Bionic arm. Head up here. Right. End. You have no combat move speed either. Oh, because you've got the... Maybe the armor is your issue. Yeah, I'll take that off. Can't unequip it in combat. Fair enough. That's fine. Um, 
Blast him. Twice. Didn't kill him. Very unfortunate. Up as far as we can go. Last. Nice. That one's running forward. That one died of the burn. Okay, cool. We'll head up here and get our extra chance to hit. And then, I don't know, just V. Can't hit anyone who's in cover anyway. Says that he's a shop? What? Is that what that means? Oh no, it's leadership. I see. He's following the leadership of that of him. That makes sense. Uh, yes. This is the button I meant to hit. It's ready to ambush. If somebody gets here. And... Oh, one shot on us, but we get to fire at Lex for that, I guess. Ow. Um, yeah, kill one of the snipers. Awesome. Oh, kill both of the snipers? Great. Love it. Uh, you're just gonna end your turn there. Okay, punch him. Wonderful. Get behind his cover. Out here. Uh, switch weapon fire. Dead. Wonderful. Yeah, okay, our new friend is, like, garbage. Although, I think he's garbage because he's wearing that armor. Uh, let's quickly take him out of the armor. Uh, now, we did pick up another one of these. We can maybe chuck that over. That might be slightly better. Um, then we need to chuck over some ammo for it. So you can have like 20 bullets. 30 bullets, I guess. That's fine. Alright, reload. I still need to get one bladed weapon, but hey, what can you do? Copy Ranger Team. Thank you. See ya. Alright, so that's a level up and a perk point. Nice. Okay, so now we can start putting points into these ones. Uh, we can get an extra one in energy weapons. It is quite useful. Yeah, I'm going to grab an extra energy weapons and commit that. Although maybe I should go for outdoorsmanship, given that he's our only one. Plus overcharge. 10% damage against non-conductive armor. Interesting. But kind of unnecessary. Um, chance from critical hits. Party-wide finding loot is always interesting. Um, base armor. Let's uh, let's say part party wide finding loot. I mean, it's a stacking buff or it's that finding ammo loot. Stacking buff, so it sounds like that'd be worthwhile getting. Because we already have one. Yeah, distribute some of that stuff. Everyone's a little bit heavy on stuff right now, but that's okay. Right, the weird guy who was there is no longer there. Head across here. So this is where we found the goop, but we have, of course, found the goop, so that bit's done. Okay. So we're heading up this way. Is this map smaller, or maybe there's another way around there? Can't get through there, because you would get through there. Oh, wait, no, that's just a dead end. Oh, that's sealed off. This map is smaller. Yeah, so that, that area was previously something. And it's now quite definitely not something anymore. Uh, all right. Well, hear me out. I'm going to kill the rifleman. Not quite, but getting there. Okay, do it again. Just because he's likely got the largest range. Uh, we'll run all the way up to that pillar. And turn. Get up here. Uh, only got 50%. We'll hit them when they move. I mean, at least he has AP now. I mean, his chance to hit... Actually, that's not bad. Okay. I take it back. His chance to hit is not bad. Oh, wait, no. That was him. Aha! I see. It, it's the person who's good with the assault rifles didn't have a bad chance to hit. That makes sense. Dead. Good. Okay, um... I'm just gonna set up an ambush there. 
I don't think anything is going to get done. I'll run up in case we need it, but again, I don't think anything's going to get done from that. Shoot. Nice. So we have uh, Hope and Takayushi leveling up. Copy Ranger. Oh, Echo. I always forget. Apologies. The uh, static. Alright, so Hope does not yet have her perk, but does have some extra points to spend. Uh, let's give her a point in Field Medic. That was a problem for us, so we'll give her a point there. Okay, Takayuki. Five points. Uh, I mean, he is our Demolition Man, so we do need to basically save up for that. Uh, in terms of everything er else, he didn't get a perk, so yeah, I mean, that's him done. Awesome. Grab some loot. Nice. Okay. Uh, yeah, see this area? Definitely, they cut off that side of it. Okay, let's go. Now, does this mean that you can't get anywhere else, or what? Yeah, so that is the- that's everything. So the rest of the Canyon of Titan doesn't exist anymore. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, in which case, we're gonna head back to Ranger Sistel and re-pick up uh, Chisel, and then probably head to the prison again. I think that sounds like a good idea. Yeah. Um, let's head over there. Now, while we're doing that, there was a comment that I just remembered that I forgot to look up. So... Let me see, I don't move while I'm alt tabbed. That's gonna be a real shame, because I wanted to look it up. Because uh, it was telling me that there was something we missed. While it's loading, I'll uh, just alt tab and tab. Not the best way to do things. Uh, let's see, it is not on the screen yet. Okay, head around there. Uh, wasteland. Nope, not that one. It may have been, ah, no, it wasn't deleted. So, um, if you head due west from Ranger HQ until you hit a wall, then head north, you should find a cache containing some stuff. Okay. Stuff which I should then take to the Rail Nomads. Alright then. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll do that. I mean, we are heading to Ranger Citadel. Uh, we could do that now, I suppose. So due west, then north. So up here, I'd assume, is where I'm going. Let me just check, is there anything? Nah, I was trying to check if there was an oasis around here. I guess that the oasis is gonna be up there. Yeah, so apparently there should be a cache in there. Yep. Just did a little northeast, southwest to check that I wasn't going crazy. So I have been this way, I must have just missed it, I guess. It's very possible. I went this way a lot earlier. Okay. So, let's just refill the canteens and have a look. Yeah, there we go. I just missed it. Perfect. Right. Also, looking at the scavenger, that kind of tells us the size of the LA map, assuming it has scavenger stuff as well. Because it's only got five left. Ah, okay. So this is the E... It's the E.T. stuff that was buried in the, uh, yeah, okay, buried in the desert. So, uh, you only need one stack. Take that to the game guy in Real Nomad. Okay. I will take, let me find somebody. I'll take one stack. Two stacks. Just to see. I don't know. Uh, and then we'll head down to Ranger Citadel again. Alright, cool. That's a nice little Easter egg. Yeah, I wonder if we've missed anything else on the map. I can't think that we have. We have kind of been thorough. I mean, I could believe that we maybe missed something, but I don't think we missed much. Unless all 16 are here, in which case I definitely missed a lot, but... Yeah, that one was just, like, right in the corner. Alright, cool. So, let's head into Ranger Citadel, drop off, um... Kane, or whatever his name is. Uh, and then get Chisel back. Because, as fun as Kane is, um, he doesn't do anything. So, I mean, why is he here? It's a good question, really. Right, head out here. Uh, it's too bad disarming that nuke made the monks lose control. Well, I mean, I had this to. This is hallowed ground, I can tell. I mean, I'd love to keep Karin and Kane around, but, 
I mean, yeah. It's not an option. A temple to consumption. Hmm. On the other hand, is gluttony a sin if there is no god? All right, cool. Um, welcome back, brothers. Belly up to the bar. That's the wrong one. Hello. Yeah, I got a new recruit. His name's Corin. Uh, Corin. He's a former servant of the Mushroom Cloud. Aren't they the ones who like to blow themselves up all the time? Hmm. Well, just keep him away from Tan, and he should be fine. Right. What kind of enlistment bonus would you like? Merit, please. Thank you. Goodbye. Right, so there's Ralphie. Right, apologies for the cut. It looks like Chisel is over here, apparently. Ah, there we go, he hangs out in the museum. Perfect. Well, I'm gonna trade in. Need some help from yep. the bandit? So we're gonna trade in Karn, dismiss him. Grab Chisel. All right, I'm ready to kill. So Karn will then spend his time here. So that, all, all that stuff just dropped on us, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. Does he still have, yeah, he still has all of his junk on him. It's all right, so we'll give him that back. Then we'll give him, what's it, use a 38? Yeah, use his 38 cal, so we'll give him all of that. Wonderful. And then all of that as well. Perfect. Right, um. Oh, just. Do that. He apparently has skill points. Those are just the ones we left him on. Yep. Awesome. Uh, I'll chuck one of those over so we can actually move. Wait, no, the Z is it the Xenon Cannon or the Meson Cannon that I want? Uh, I think I want the Xenon Cannon and I don't want the Meson Cannon. Yeah. yeah. So we'll chuck that over. Anything else that we're uh, holding on to that's... Oh, the Uzi maybe? Yeah, that can go back over there. Perfect. Oh, and the 9mm stuff can maybe go off the Uzi, just in case we want to use it. Right, how are we looking? Everybody's looking good. Awesome, awesome. Right, so the only place we've got left to go is uh, Rail Nomads, and then we've got to go to... Yeah, we got to go to Rail Nomads. Ooh, what, what happened to the camera there? We got a little stuck. Wait. Oh, these guys are stuck, that's why. Yeah. Okay, right. As I was saying, we gotta go to Rail Nomads, and then we gotta go to the prison. So we're gonna quickly go run up to Rail Nomads, and then I think off camera, I'm gonna come back here and sell a bunch of stuff, because uh, we have a bunch of stuff to get rid of. So that would seem very sensible to go and do a little bit of selling at some point. Right, so let's head to wait. Uh, let's head to the wasteland, and then to the game guy, who actually I think you can get to very quickly from Real Nomads. Yeah, because there's the uh, back door that we took last time. Yeah, so all the way up there, and we can skip all of the random encounters as well, which is very nice. So every time we get one, we'll just skip it. Uh, can we get there? And yeah, if we can get there with half water, then we're laughing. Yeah, I think we can. Awesome. Yeah, so in we go. You go to the Atchison's camp, you get one load, then you go backwards and then you get the other load. Yeah, so we go back this way to get the second load. Uh, wait for ev get everyone closer, there we go. Then you get the second load. That then allows you to head up to the uh, game. There we go. A uh, all the way over here. Yep. So into that one. Oh, some of them are stupid. So we'll just have to guide them. Yeah, I think you have to go all the way around, which is fine. Okay, round here, and then in. There we go. So now all of them know which direction they're going. So we'll head in here. And Why would you play a game where you can beat some asshole up when there's real assholes in the street every day? Good point. Uh, did we ever open this? Yup, that's my baby. I take care of that scope like it's my own child. Oh, okay. Hello. I can't imagine where you found that thing or what you had to do to get it, but I'm impressed. We found an ET cartridge. What? 
There are some things you just don't joke about in life, my friend. No joke, we really did find it. You have found my holy grail. I'd give you my firstborn if I had one, but this will have to do instead. We received the clay wizard figure and a thousand scrap. Uh, we have more, want them? Having more than one would just ruin the rarity of my collection. Besides, I'm running low on scrap. Hey, maybe you should bury them so nobody else can have one. Yeah, okay. Come again, anytime. It's an idea. Uh, right, where are we? Yeah, just dump on the ground. The only time where this is a useful feature. Right, um, so who got the clay wizard figurine? Uh, there it is. Perception armor. Oh, we already have one. Yeah, okay, awesome. So basically we got a thousand scrap for doing that. Okay, cool. It's a nice little Easter egg. And it completed our, it got us further towards our finding random scrap in the wasteland stuff. Right, well, I'm going to end the episode here. And next time, we're going to be in Ranger Citadel. And I'm going to have gone and equipped us all. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.